officer involved shooting today in the same neighborhood where a six-year-old boy was shot last Friday. Good evening, I'm Alicia Garcia. And I'm Phil Aldridge. One man was shot and killed. It happened on East Signal Drive in Star Village. According to the Rapid City Police Department and the Pennington County Sheriff's Office, two men were believed to be in violation of no contact orders. They say one of the men came out of the residence with an injury to his body. Now, it's unclear what caused the injury. Police say the other man is believed to have five active warrants for his arrest and was holding a gun at the time of the incident. And the situation, it escalated from there. The male that was in violation of the no contact order ran from the scene. Officers gave chase. While they were giving chase, the officers were telling the male to get his hands out of his pockets. They could see he had his hands down by his waistband. As one of the officers came around a corner of a residence, he noticed the male holding a gun. And when the officer came around the corner, the individual pointed the gun at the police officer. The officer fired at the suspect after telling him to drop the gun. And at that point, the individual dropped to the gun and fell to the ground. The investigation has been handed over to the Division of Criminal Investigation and the Attorney General's Office will review the incident. The shooting is believed by both police and sheriff's office to have no connection to the shooting last week in the same area. One of the two men has died as a result of his injury. The other man was just injured, but it's unknown which man died.